Welcome back everyone, General Turner here, coming back with a brand new COC episode. And so my friends, it is time for a change. It is time to take this channel to the next level. So for those of you that have been watching my videos over the last week or so, and of course, keeping up to date with all of the social media from Supercell, you will know there is a huge, and I mean huge, update that will be hitting this game very shortly, hopefully within the next one to two weeks. So I see it like this. We have maybe one to two weeks max to do whatever we want within the game, and then once the update does launch, we will start to, you know, show you guys all of the new content, farm it all up, and of course do some awesome gemming episodes. So stay tuned, and of course subscribe to the channel for that. But I was thinking of it this way, we are approaching 700,000 subs, we have a week or so to do whatever we want on the channel, and I've decided to dedicate this entire week to your ideas. So pretty much this is what I want you to do right now. Go down below in that comment section and give me one word. Now what this word has to be is it has to be a name of a troll base. So I'm going to make a troll base about your word. So say if you want to call the troll base a snake, comment snake and I will come up with a snake troll base. Literally every single one of you go down below in that comment section and just comment one word, make it original and I will build a troll base around that. So hopefully we're going to do seven troll bases one every single day of course we do do two videos on the channel so there will be something different as well but troll bases are so damn fun just before this update launches we are going to really entertain you guys on the channel so to start it off i've decided to drop down from 5k trophies of course all the way down to two and a half k so we've made a massive drop we dropped about 2,000 cups and we're going to start this off by doing an anti-miner troll base. I know you won't believe it guys, but I was just attacked by 48 max level miners against this base and he didn't even get a one star. So we're gonna show you that replay and then we're gonna continue the episode. So check this out, check this out. You won't actually believe this, but this is what the troll base itself looks like. So it's pretty much like, you know, just stashed loads of money in the center there. I mean, you've got the dark elixir, the gold and the elixir all in the center. There are a couple of inferno towers around it. And of course, you've got the four expos set to ground. But apart from that, if you manage to take out the inferno towers, that loot is free. Nothing's going to stop you, or that's what they think at least. Unknown to them, we have so many traps inside of this little center here. But you're about to see that for yourself, guys. So check it out. He's got 48 miners, a level 30 queen, a level 10 grand warden, and five kill spells. Now, the guy actually spams in nearly every single one of the miners on the right hand side he also has some additional miners inside of his clan castle just so just stay tuned and see what happens so check it out guys the miners pop up but of course they have entered hell there is no escape for them now they're going to get crushed in seconds those miners have been destroyed he actually dropped a heal spell there and obviously there's nothing there to heal so the inferno tower was still standing still alive just about taking out the last couple of miners are they going to be able to take it out no they are not i don't believe so he drops a second, sorry, a third heal spell down the bottom near those expos, but it's just not looking great, guys. Here we go. So he's got some miners, and I think there was some giants inside of the CC. Didn't do anything there. The Grand Warden has arrived, but of course, he's going to get taken out. So if we swing down the bottom of the base, you can see the miners are still alive. The queen is still there. They're starting to make their way onto the town hall, but there is not enough of them left. They've just been melted. This is the worst mass miner attack I've ever seen. And believe it or not, they are maxed out miners. Level 4, 48 of them, and they couldn't one-star a troll base. That is pretty damn bad, I'm not going to lie. I know he didn't have his Barbarian King, but still, he got whooped. And check it out, guys, we only lost a single gold storage. So I asked you at the start of the episode to go down below and, of course, comment one word of a troll base you want me to make. You can still do that, and, of course, I will pick some of you over the next couple of days. So this week is going to be all about you guys the subscribers so do not forget if you do want the chance to win a $25 gift card we are giving away $250 for the 700,000 subscribers special so hopefully we will hit 700k subs soon we are so close so so close if you want the chance to win a $25 gift card all you need to do is leave a like on this video to show some support to the channel let's go for 5,000 likes guys do not forget, of course, to sub to the channel to stay up to date with the giveaways and the videos. Now, there is a link in the description box. The giveaway is going to end maybe two to three days time. Hit the link, hit enter, and you will be entered into the giveaway. So there was another reason why I decided to drop this low. For those of you that know, I'm starting to max out my Town Hall 11 base. And I heard rumors that there is some serious loot down here inside of the Crystal 1 League. So we're going to test that out now. We are going to go in for some live attacks. Just before we do, we are going to prepare the next army. So we are using the standard army. Me. I always like to use this guys it's very simple and to be honest with you it just gets the job done so we're going to be using eight bowlers inside of each one of these dark elixir barracks if you're new to the channel you will probably never have seen this strategy before 
and if you've uh, been subbed to the channel for a while, you're probably sick to death of this strategy because I use it all the time. But you know what? Once the update does launch, we will switch it up. We will definitely change things up on the channel. Hopefully there's some new walls, some new defenses, some new traps. Just something really awesome that Supercell's going to treat us with. So we're ready. The King's ready. The Queen, Grand Warden, Heroes, and of course, the Spells and the Troops. So here we go. Check it out. Let me take you through a live uh, a live look at this, uh, what is it? This Crystal One League. We're inside of the Crystal One League. So I haven't been here for probably about a year. We haven't been inside of the Crystal League for near enough, I would say, a year. I, I honestly think last September, October was the last time I was this low in trophies. Let's see what kind of loot it's offering a Town Hall 11. So it's not great so far. Here we go. Half a million gold, not bad. Let's keep looking though. I've heard there are great things about this league. Not bad again. Wow, okay, yeah, not bad. Decent, very decent indeed. Can we find though a, wow, okay. There's a dead base right here, guys. I mean, look, it's offering four and a half thousand Dark Elixir. You know what? Let's just hit this. I mean, it's an easy easy three-star. Even the, uh, the Eagle Artillery smoking. There is no way I can abandon this. We're going to go in for a couple of live attacks, so don't worry. Stay tuned to the channel, guys. This episode is only going to get better, so check it out. We're just going to drop in these Earthquake spells there. I mean, if I don't triple-star this, then I will delete the channel. I will officially delete the channel if I do not three-star this base. You know what? I'm actually scared now. Are we going to do this? Okay, so let's get it done, guys. Let's get this done. So we're going to drop Archer, Archer. Archer, Archer. Let's just drop those Archers over there. Here goes the uh, the Giants. There go the Giants. Grand Warden, Queen. Got to drop in the healers nice and early. I'm guessing there aren't going to be any of those. Um, oh, oh, oh. Okay, yeah, this is looking dodgy. I'm not going to lie. You know what? We're going to drop in a Rage Spell nice and early. So there we go, guys. Going to drop in these Bowlers now. Hopefully going to funnel them in towards those buildings there. And there goes the Barbarian King. No, don't go off to that side, please. Okay, we're going to pop the Grand Warden's ability. The entire army has scattered, guys. This isn't looking good. We may have to delete the channel. Okay, I take back what I said. We're not going to be deleting the channel, but here we go. Going to drop in the second Rage Spell into the center. Oh, the bowler's going to funnel in. Here we go. Check it out, guys. We are going to drop down that free spell on that silly little air defense there. Okay, yeah, this hasn't been a great start, but you know what? We should still be able to clean it up for a three-star. Let's see what happens. So we're going to pop the Grand Warden. Sorry, the King's Ability. The Giants are in the center. It's looking decent. I mean, the, uh, the healers have all been taken out, but it shouldn't be too much of an issue, guys. The Queen's over on the right-hand side. Just going to chuck down some of those wall breakers there. Just, you know, distract maybe some of those defenses. There goes the Queen's Ability. She's going to take out a couple of those final defenses. Still a lot of loot left inside of the base, guys. Bowlers, Giants, King making their way around the right-hand side. The Grand Warden's still there. Up to 77% so far, so not long to go. Definitely one of the worst attacks we've done for a while. We didn't manage to funnel in the troops there properly, but hopefully we can do this. Only 20% left required, and we will have three-starred the base. You know what? Let's drop a poison on that King. Yeah, he's not even in the poison zone, is he? Okay, so the bowlers are going to swarm the king. He has no escape. He's going to get slaughtered there. Come on, bowlers. Take him out. There we go, guys. He's going down pretty slowly. There he goes. Finally take out the uh, the barbarian king. We're up to 86% so far. Giant's still alive, of course. Going to do some real damage. The air defense is getting splash damage done to it. Is there anything left over there? Nope, it's just a couple of... Uh, what is it? One final defense. Just a cannon. So we've done it. We three-starred it. We will be going in for another live attack. We're going to gem up some troops and see what else we can find. So let me know where you're farming. Is your loot as good as this? So check it out. You actually saw when I was showing you earlier. The loot is very decent, but I believe we can find something a little bit better. I've heard rumors of a million plus gold and elixir raids. So I'm talking one million of each. That is what I've been hearing about the Crystal One League. I'm not sure if it's true. I'm not sure if we will be able to find that, but we're definitely going to go and have a look. So there goes the final building. Only seconds remaining in the raid. Picked up quite a decent amount of loot there. Obviously, the loot bonus kind of sucks, but you know what? We can deal with that, guys. If the loot's great, the loot bonus doesn't really matter too much. So we've just pushed back up into the Masters League. Not what we wanted to do. Definitely not what I wanted, but it doesn't really matter too much. Shouldn't be much of a difference. So let's just go ahead and gem ourselves up the rest of these army troops. So here we go. Bowl is going to come with us, going to gem the spells, and then finally, we will need to bring ourselves the hero. So the king, the queen, and of course, the grand warden. Now, for those of you that are interested, we will be keeping this troll base for maybe another 24 hours. Then I will show you some awesome replays on it. Do not forget, though, we do do two episodes every single day, so it's not just going to be trolling. So here we go. We've just landed on this Town Hall 11 base. Now, I know I said I was looking for a million plus loot, but this isn't bad, and the reason I'm going to take it on is it's actually a rush Town Hall 11. So we could possibly three-star it using an army like this. I'm not going to jinx it, though. 
let's just see what actually happens. So we're going to drop in the Earthquake spells just over here. Should be a very decent entry point. Going to do Double Giant and then, of course, send in the Wall Breakers, guys. So here we go. The rest of the army should be funneling in towards the center there. Going to drop down the Wizards on a nice little spread. Hopefully clear out the rest of those buildings. And then, of course, we can send in the Barbarian King and all of the other units. So here we go. Going to pop the Grand Warden's ability nice and early to make sure those Inferno Towers and, of course, those other troops. No, we just misplaced that free spell. I was actually aiming for the Eagle Artillery, but it didn't really work too well. So we're defending Pekka inside of the Clan Castle. Gets slaughtered in seconds. Wow, check that out, guys. So there we go. Second Rage Spell is going to get dropped down. We're going to pop the King's Ability. He's going down on the left-hand side. These bowlers are doing some serious destruction inside of the base. I didn't expect it to go this well this quick. But check it out, guys. They've destroyed quite a lot of... Uh, whoa, whoa. They've destroyed pretty much everything. Barbarian King over on the left hand side gonna take out some of those archer towers as well. It's looking great It is definitely looking great. The Queen is on the right hand side the healers There is one one healer alive so we could do this we could do this guys We could possibly three-star this base. Let's just not jinx it and see what happens. You know what? I don't think it's gonna be possible Actually, it could be possible. We still got the Queen's ability left to use She's gonna be taking out some of these defenses. Larry's are getting in the way though. That's gonna cause a problem Gonna cause the queen to get stuck. You know what? We're not gonna three-star it, but it doesn't really matter too much. We grabbed half a million loot, so that's all I really wanted. And of course, we've got a 100% loot bonus. So we are gonna win that there. We don't need to carry on in the raid, guys. Check it out. Over half a million gold. So that pretty much demonstrates you what the loot is like here down in the Crystal 1 slash Masters 3 League. Let me know what you think about it. Stay tuned to the channel. There will be a second episode coming shortly. But of course, let me know a single word and I will make a troll base out of it. Peace out.